First, disinfect your culture hood and equipment with 70% ethanol. Once your equipment is disinfected and ready, you can begin plating your cells. Set your pipette to 27 microliters and place as many drops on the lid of the petri dish. If your pipette tip happens to touch the lid of the petri dish or any other area, be sure to change pipette tips to avoid contamination. Once you have fit as many drops as you can on the lid, add PBS to the bottom portion of the petri dish to assure the drops will not dry out. The lid can now be turned right side up and placed carefully on top of the dish. The dish is then labeled and stored in a cell culture incubator for three days. Carefully remove your hanging drop plates from incubation and place in a tissue culture hood. Remove the lid of the plate containing the drops that were plated in the previous lab. Using 2-3 to three milliliters of media, rinse the drops from the surface of the plate down to the bottom. Be sure to take your time rinsing the bodies from the plate. Hold the plate with the drops at a 45 degree angle and use a sterile pipette tip to gently wash the cells down into the rim of the dish. Be careful not to let the media spill over the rim. You will have to use some of the media which collects at the rim to wash the plate several times until all the EBs are removed from the surface of the dish. After the EBs are rinsed from the surface of the dish, transfer the media and the embryoid bodies from the petri dish into a sterile culture flask. You then store the flask in a cell culture incubator. After incubation, this is what your embryoid body should look like under the microscope. 